Alright guys, what's up? This is Sonic Soul here. I wanted to go ahead and, you know, watch this little trailer here. Because I have been out of the loop for like two to three days now. Because I just recently built a new computer. Uh, or rather, I upgraded my old one. So now I'm lightning fast in the PC world of Guilty Gear Strive. I was just so busy waiting for my parts to come in. But now I'm here and I want to see what this Gold Lewis dude is all about. I thought it was going to be Jam. I thought it was going to be Jacko. You know, I love my waifus, but <laughs> it seems they're probably saving them for later, you know, just to grab those people back in. And I think they're starting off with the with the one character they want to like push, like a new character, which I think is uh, a nice choice. Anyway, guys, if you enjoy my content, definitely leave a thumbs up on the video and subscribe so that way you get to see more cool stuff from this channel that's Guilty Gear related. And hit the notification bell so you know exactly when I'm going to upload those videos. But without further ado, let's just get right into this Gold Lewis Dickinson trailer. We have that to look at and the introduction video. So let's see. Peggy 12. Subject file 2534. Speech level intelligence confirmed. Preparing to capture. Preparing to capture. <laughs> okay, his theme ain't too bad. <laughs> big and burly like him, right? Yeah. It's <laughs> not a big deal. What's that? Not a big deal. Oh, God. What, what is that? God. <laughs> oh, no. My man got the coffin. Give him the, the headbutt. Oh my god, was that a 6P? He got the the drone? Yo, Gatlings. Yo, Gatlings. <laughs> we got Gatlings now? Oh shit! Is that the Chris Redfield, the Marvel 3 throwback with the satellites? Oh shit! Oh, that's it? Damn. Oh snap, this, so this is the, the, the road map. Oh, do we got anything playing after this? Oh, I guess that's it. All right, so the roadmap is the first thing. Gold Lewis comes out July twenty seventh, twenty twenty one. That's how many? How many days? Yo, that's next week Tuesday. That's OD. That's next week Tuesday. That's not that far off. And then the next character is August twenty twenty one, and then we don't even know when the next character's coming out. And then there's 2022 for the other. I, I don't know, man. I mean, you see, like, I I don't know about that, right? Because having it wait until, like, 2022, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, but, hey, it's cool, right? And I guess it comes out with uh, other stages and stuff, right? With the side story. So they're probably trying to release it for, like, the big, big release. Yeah. If it's twenty early 2022 release, that'd be great. That would be super great. Um... But yeah, I, I really hope one of these characters is Jacko or Elfelt. Like, honestly, if it was Elfelt, it'd probably be Happy Chaos. They're literally the same character in a way. But I would definitely love uh, Jacko. Uh, and she's in the story as well. I, I'd definitely like to see that. But Gold Lewis Dickinson, huh? Let's see this uh, starter guide now. <laughs> Gold Lewis Dickinson. A character who can effectively poke, mix up, and keep the opponent locked down by attacking with his coffin. Take the opponent down with his undeniable, overwhelming power. Behemoth Typhoon. Gold Lewis. Behemoth Typhoon. Oh! A variety of attacks by inputting a half circle in the direction of your choice and HS. As the oh! So it's a half circle motion. That's the, that's the throwback. That's like Dudley. It's like Dudley. I mean, obviously, he's a completely different character, but the inputs feel like that. In the sense, because Dudley has a lot of half circles for his moves, but it's kind of interesting, right? Like he, if you do it forward, he'll go forward. If you do it back, he'll go back. Right? Like that. That's kind of sick. I wonder if he could swing it up. Wait, does he have a a, a half circle like? Like where you go like this, or like or like this. That's kind of that's kind of weird. Attack properties vary greatly depending on. Oh, he does. He does. That's crazy. So that means so that means one of them is like an anti-air. Oh, that's so weird. 
hold the final direction after the command has been inputted in order to activate Behemoth Typhoon. Eight way? In this Behemoth Typhoon, Gold Lewis swings his coffin from behind him to the front, going low. Uh. The range is long enough that this attack will reach the opponent, even oh my canceled from the edge God. of far standing S or crouching S. Oh, he could In whiff cancel it? Typhoon, Gold Lewis swings his coffin from behind him to the front, going high. This is overhead a range overhead, meaning of course, opponent <laughs> who is blocking low from a of distance. course, of if course, bro. Into its active frames, and what is this gauge? Oh my speed. god, if it hits meaty, it up with other versions of behemoth typhoon. Mm. The opponent mm. off guard. Okay, in this behemoth typhoon. Gold Lewis swings his coffin from in front of him to behind, going low. The quick uh, that's a low. Easy to use and include in combos. That's that's cool. In this behemoth Charlie negative. Gold Lewis swings his anti coffin from in front of him to behind, going high. Definitely an anti mm -hmm. This move has a long range and sends the opponent flying up on hit. Yeah, he could probably juggle after that typhoon, on later frames, Gold Lewis or he could RC it. His coffin down forward from above him. This is an overhead attack with a rather fast startup and cannot be blocked mm. by crouching opponents. In this behemoth, another fight, overhead. Gold Lewis swings his coffin forward from down low to above. It's Ooh. easy to go for a follow up after this move as it lifts the enemy up high. That's pretty cool. In this behemoth typhoon, Gold Lewis swings his coffin from above to below, going behind him. This now, how would you use this one? And cannot be blocked by standing oh. opponents. If it connects late into its active frames, it you get a combo. Up on. Yeah, you get a combo. Break through your opponent's defense with the mm. overhead and low versions of Behemoth Typhoon. In this That's Behemoth cool. Typhoon, Gold Lewis swings his coffin from below to above, going behind him. As this attack knocks the opponent back, it works well. Ooh, he swings his sticks! You want to change position. Mm. Mm. That's so sick! Run that back! Run that back! Run that back! That one actually. Yo, that one swings him back and side switches? Come on, dog. That's kind of ridiculous. That's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> That's kind of OD. And I wonder if they have. uh, I wonder if they have hitboxes behind him. Mm -mm. What is that bar though? The security level yeah. increases as time passes. Certain special moves become more powerful when the security level is high. Right, so you the get to use the Gatling gun longer. After one of these special moves is used. Mm. Look for the right time to use these special Set play? Moves. Set play? Yeah, set play, set play. Thunderbird. Set play. So so I'm a, so so this move, this this drone right here. I guarantee you, this is gonna be used to set play somebody after he hard knocks them down with the behemoth or like with a 2D or something. He's gonna set play you and then he's gonna go for a, 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 a free behemoth to guard break you. I'm, yo, he literally has Eno notes. That's crazy. He has, I wonder if his Eno notes are better because they go straight forward. No, but nope, she could direct her note, but they're, they look faster. Oh no, that looks like it has some startup. It looks like it has some startup. Thunderbird. Yo, set play. Gold Lewis set to play. Projectile that moves forward. Thunderbird. When the security mm. level is high, it covers a longer distance and increases the number of hits. <laughs> yep. Although it has <laughs> some startup, it creates an Three opportunity hits. to go on the offense once the projectile yep. is out. High, low, left, right. Yo, that's so cheap. 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 Ew, yo, so cheap. That's cheap. Gold Lewis sends out extremely fast skyfish projectiles. Minigun Gatling increases when the security level is high. You're gonna use this in combo enders. You can deal a good amount of chip damage. To the chip damage, yup. They have to FD, they have also, to do FD. Like Thunderbird, this can counter your opponent's projectiles. Skyfish can be used. Stop it. I am the zoner. <laughs> I am the zoner. <laughs> Down with the system. Is invincible on startup and sends the opponent flying away on hit. Can you get a follow up? You can go for major damage by using this. In mm. You can perform a follow up mm. attack mm. when mm. it hits at close range. Mm. He said, move by in the 
direction of your choice and key. That did mad life! It's powered up depending on the number of full circle commands inputted. Does it depend? Okay, I gotta run it back. How does that work again? You can perform this move by inputting a full circle in the direction of your choice and key. The move is powered up depending on the number of full circle commands inputted. Wait, what? So you could do you could do a multiple amount of a multiple amount of half circle backs? Powered up depending on the number of full circle commands inputted. The move is what? full circle in the direction of Huh? Perform a follow-up attack when this hits at close range. You can perform this move by inputting a full circle in the direction of your choice and key. The move is what? Up depending on the number of full circle commands inputted. So you you definitely yeah it's like a, it sounds like it's an SPD. That sounds like it's an SPD input. That yeah that you feel like that's an SPD input that they're implying or a, a 360 or 720 motion. So if you input it properly, like you get a powered up version of the super. That's crazy. You turning that SPD butter, bro. Emergency. <laughs> you turning that butter, baby. You doing the SPD, baby. SPD emergency. <laughs> That's wild. Burn it down. An attack that fires a laser that moves in from a distant. The Chris Redfield satellite. Yeah, the Chris. The Chris. Times, Chris Field satellite. Keep the opponent locked down, mm -hmm. both when this attack hits and is blocked. Yeah, when they're forced to take it. Yep. High, the number of hits increases. Increases. Possible to keep the opponent locked down even mm. more. As it hits a wide range, this set play to catch the opponent from a distance. You know what I? You know what I'm wondering? Can you PRC that? Can you PRC this and approach them? Do a block string. The laser hits them and do another. Yo, that's mad set play. That's mad set play. That's mad set play. Yo, this super. Uh, fast PRC is gonna be OD, bro. <laughs> That's gonna be OD. And because the laser comes out later, what if you put BRC on their wake up? Oh my god. Oh my god. What if, right, he does it? It doesn't, he's able to act before the laser comes out. Did you BRC in front of them? <laughs> Yo, that's so cheap. That's cheap, dude. That's so cheap. That's actually mad cheap. Stop. Stop. Catch the opponent from a distance. Use each version mm -hmm. of the human typhoon mm -hmm. for suitable situations. Mm -hmm. Putting pressure on the opponent. <laughs> the for look what he did. Look what he did. <laughs> Fuck it. Yo, my man did a fucking whiff cancel. That's fucked up, dude. Yo, he's just like, he has chip whiff cancels. Oh and no! The opponent with each version's strength. The grounded version is especially useful mm. as it sends the opponent mm. back mm. even when blocked. Mm. It's also vital to make good use mm. of the mm. mm. to bring the opponent into close range where you want them. You can always rely on burn it down when you have ten into close range. Bro, are you serious? They don't care about yo. Why? Oh, you a big body oh, Yo, you hate to see this type of oh, thing happen. Oh, they really, they really are just like, yo, yeah, she, the, the, definitely, bro. Just definitely. Down, you have tension gauge for it. Once the opponent is in your range, use Behemoth Typhoon until you take them down. Thanks for watching. Okay, so this super, th th or this character, right? Like, he, he is definitely like the brawler. Like, he's a brawler. He's a brawler. He's trying to get in, obviously, using the, the the Thunderbird. Is that what it's called? Or the, the drone? He's going to try to set play you with that. Any hit he gets, he's going to try to to convert that into the set play drone. So that way he could go for high, low, left, right, right? And the thing about that, too, is because he could whiff cancel his normals, you have to be careful about his movement. He could whiff cancel to to move himself forward and some of the behemoth typhoons are faster than others i'm sure well if all of them guard break they're not really negative that's kind of cheap that's kind of cheap since a, ma a majority of them yeah since a majority of them guard break what the hell are you gonna do it said his ease of use is three stars mm. 
Your Eno, you Eno main time to play Gold Dick Lewis. <laughs> Gold Dick Lewis. But yeah, I think I think Gold Lewis looks really cool. Like, oh, for what it's worth, like people were like, "Yo, this is a sleeper character." They really thought like he's a sleeper character, but when you think about like how his inputs are, the way you're gonna have to utilize his slow movement along with these long range lunging attacks bro like yeah you definitely got he's definitely he's not somebody you're gonna have to, he's not someone to, to underestimate because like he looks like he has a lot of strong special moves in his arsenal the last thing i wanted to t kind of talk about i feel like people are expecting like a balance update with this character coming i think it's too early for a balance patch update right now i feel like they're gonna just let the game rock like like it is right now and then later on maybe like in after the summer or like at the second pat second dlc upgrade they're gonna probably do a patch like maybe in august yeah yeah i don't think we're gonna get anything until after evo and that's like that's probably the the, the earliest I don't even think we're gonna get like anything in terms of a balance change. So I think people need to temper their expectations. People definitely need to temper their expectations right now. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think we should be looking for a patch right now. I think we should just be enjoying the fact that we have an interesting character right now that we could play as. Like I think Gold Lewis Dickinson is definitely cool. I'll try him out. I love set play. I love set play characters. So and his his uh, other meter looks interesting enough. The security level meter it looks interesting enough. So yeah, I might try him out. He don't he don't look terrible. He looks pretty cool. I'll try him out. Anyway, that's my impressions. That's what I think about Gold Lewis Dickinson. I will definitely try him out on release. I I think he's really cool. And yeah, I mean, hopefully they release uh, some waifus at the end of this too. But if not it's cool i'll just play this out you know I, I like his design and i really like that he references uh chris redfield's level three from uh ultimate marvel 3 so that's definitely he definitely has a cool design and i'm interested to see what uh what other characters they plan to put in here as well as how they're gonna go about changes in the future anyway guys if you enjoyed this video once again subscribe definitely leave a comment down below let me know uh what you think about gold lewis and what other characters you're looking forward to and subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you know the next time i upload another video uh but yeah thanks for coming to my uh little gold lewis tech talk tech talk ted talk <laughs> reaction video peace out